lost in winners to... What did you lose to? Um, Let's take a look at that. I'm not sure right now, but we're into the match. <laughs> Forward actually going to go Falco. He warmed up Sheik. A little bit confusing. His tag is an homage to one of his old school combo videos, Combos on Colorado Kids. He had a couple of them, right? And you, you know about that. You're uh, absolutely. Right? And mm -hmm. he's definitely wearing that tag because of the massive amount of Colorado cheering that has been going on in this crowd today. Just an assertion of dominance over Colorado. He's not if, even playing a Colorado player right now. <laughs> nah. Though he might not know who Far is, he might assume he's from Colorado. <laughs> Some of Far's friends are here. Um, we have other RG people. Um, Grio is here. Meds as well. Far's a very talented player. We don't really see him that much. We saw him at Evo where he notably beat Hugo. Forward, Moon walked off the stage. Not what we want to see. Sometimes life happens to you. Sometimes you kind of make life happen to you. For Far's credit, he's staying safe. Playing the matchup well. And punishes Sheik's very punishable recovery with a backer on the platform. Finally able to take a stock. Operating from a pretty significant deficit though. Good execution. So far in losers lost in the round of 16 to Axe. It was 3-1. So you know, he took a game off Axe. Axe does go some characters, but still very impressive. And he's handling forward quite well here. Forward staying high, coming down with these big strings of aerials. Personally, I can't remember the last time I saw Forge Falco at a big, big event. Mm -hmm. so this is really a treat to see. Shine Bear, let's go. One of the progenitors of modern Falco for sure. Bomb Soldier famously handed over the reins to him. Now let's see what he can do with it. Great laser, works his way back in from the corner. Risky spot. He's got a great handle on when Far likes to come in, especially with dash attack. Ford respecting the shield. Ah, uh, that's, what's uh, that? that's safe. not safe? That's that not might safe? not be safe. That might, in some cases, have some counterplay that lead to your death. That might not be safe. Far looking solid. Tries to go for an F throw game. Forward hits him with the old school. Wake up down here from off the ledge. Good Very job to just keep him off of him. Yeah. No. Ford wanted to play the platforms, but good DI from far got him back. Oh. That was a crazy fair. Can't believe we pushed him off the stage like that. Oh, oh. God. Oh, boy. That is frustrating. Two low percent deaths uh, just entirely caused by him. He was in control for really gigantic amounts of that game. Far is going to take this. We go to Yoshi's. So forward does a little bit better on the SD side. Stick with Falco. He was looking really strong on this character. He definitely was. I'm excited to see how he operates on this stage. Oh, that was cute. That was really, really good. Let's go forward. Forward recently uh, getting second place at a large-ish Arizona tournament, the uh, Dream League tournament on the ASU Tempe campus. Who won that, Betts? Um, I believe so. Yeah. Meds one, four, two. Forward a very, very strong competitor. I would call this an upset for sure. Definitely would be. But uh, forward looking strong, only taking 76%, able to kill off the top with that down, down tilt. The crowd into this, but they're almost like, everyone seems nervous. Nervous and sad. <laughs> nervous that he's going to kill himself and sad about the SDs in game one. Right now, he really seems to have far down in neutral, where he's moving where he's trying to poke in. Woo! Far got the wall jump for good measure. Finds his way off of the stage with the Forda. That's gonna lead into a decently large combo, but... Yeah, we'll take it. All right. Up here doesn't kill, but grabbing the ledge and having him not recover is gonna... Ford safely making his way to a pretty big lead here in game two. Redeeming himself in game one. These fares are ridiculous. These are the most fares I've seen in a long time that have been this well intentioned. Those from <laughs> the Arizona Far Fan Club. Yeah, Arizona getting out cheered. Rare. I really think it is nervousness. But I, think I like just uh, kind of spooked. I like Far's naming convention, taking after uh, the man Dart yeah. with the exclamation Darts. mark. 
Far. Yeah, it's a great name. It is a very, very good name. Ooh, let's go far. But yeah, it looks like forward is completely downloaded. Super at his head. I haven't seen any other characters out of far than Sheik, so he's gonna have to stick it out with him. Yeah, every single thing Far is doing, defensively or offensively, forward is a great handle on. It's a situation where he just sees the movement, he sees where Far wants to go, he sees Far's options, and he's ready with counterplay every single step of the way. Oh! That was nice! That one's for the fans. That one is for the uh, three Far fans here. Oh, we're trying to finish up this edge guard. Oh, oh. no, don't. Just barely misses the double dip there. All right, well done. That was some pretty impressive movement out of forward. Yeah. That was honestly kind of a whooping. That game was a whooping. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure where he's going to go after this. I think we uh, might have misspoke. The uh, cock tag is probably actually for cock lot. Oh, God, yeah, that's right. That's the other That's the other crew that isn't Pooh Feast. Yes. Cocklot, from what I heard, was born out of a rivalry with Poop Feast. With Poop Feast, of course. Like, people just wanted to give Poop Feast a rival, so they very, created Very, very esteemed, very esteemed clans of Arizona. We go back to probably the 14th century or so. And Far bringing out this Falco, I haven't seen this in a long time. We saw this at EVO 2015, I believe. I think he got something like 33rd or 49th up there. Did very well for himself. Nobody really knew who he was. Uh, now he's got a bit more name recognition. Number one player in Sonora, Hug Slayer. <laughs> the Sonora cheering crowd still here. Arizona very quiet. Just, you know, quiet recognition. Oh, turned out to be safe. Far doing yeah. really well in this Falco Diddle so far. Interesting that you go Falco here. Because when you counter pick, you know, if you win here, you can't go back. You can't play Sheik here or something like that. What we might see is Falco for the rest of the set. And oh. That tends to be the way it goes. If somebody... Oh! Bad so laser. Worked out well. Amazing crouch cancel to get the F-Smash in the first place. Then, unfortunately, misses the uh, sweet spot. Oh, he's, is he dead? He's dead. Oh, my God. This is confusing. Far. Yeah, Far coming out. Super strong this game. Oh, he's looking to finish this off. Forward with more of these really oh. tricky fares that most of the time people don't see coming. Yeah, everything Far's doing is working this game. I think he's going to stick with Falco. Oh, nice great tech. tech. Forward gets the grab. Ford wanted that edge guard situation. He knows he hasn't had a high percent. He wants to finish off the stock immediately. Otherwise, he's just going to take way more damage than he can handle. And it feels like the patient zoning game that Far played, or the Ford played game two, and really contained the Sheik very well, just did not work against Far's Falco at all. Which I mean, I guess you know you can see that from the results, but it might just be a matchup thing. So we heading might, we back might see Ford change the style. So you, are you saying he might become more aggressive? He might go aggro into him. He might try and be a little bit more proactive in certain spots in neutral. Just where Faller's been calling out the defensive thing and using Falco's amazing hitboxes to just punish him for it. There we go. He's not letting Far get up there. In the past, he would maybe let Far get up there and then bait the movement from the platform. Now Ford's just going at him. Oh, that would have been nice. He can still pick this up. Well done. A little bit of life in AZ now. Crowd still seems yeah. nervous. Yeah, they're definitely just freaking out a little bit. Yeah. Pop a forward. No one wants to see him lose in Arizona. Oh! And there's the big combos. Bring him all the way across the stage. The eyes away from Shine Dare. But he ends up pretty far out, but he does recover. Shine grab. Okay. How old school are you? Look pretty good right now. And there we go. Now Easy's getting some confidence into this. And I think we saw a very similar start to the last game, except from the other way around. Yeah. These games are just going back and back of who's just deeply controlling the whole game. Okay. Great bait by forward with that. Oh, double shot forward. You could do that. 
Yeah, forward looks great. Wow, great cover. Woo, try to push him off. This is a pretty crazy set. There are a lot of very unusual neutral moves. Oh, oh. hate to see that happen. But Far was the beneficiary of a lot of those game one. Ford looking much more comfortable this game. Yeah, okay, great. St starts going on this brand new combo. Taking Far it up can't to 64%. Get in it. He was uh, almost oh. looking like Squid there, staying in his shield, allowing Far to push him back to the ledge. Yeah, a little bit. It's fucked. Every single time he's shining at that height, Far has been aiming at it. Ford's been using that as a bait very, very well. Great tech of the shine out of shield. Shine. Oh, caught the jump. Looking for weak bear dare. Oh, that was the closest range power shield. Now forward, just trying not to take any risks. Staying as safe as he can. Not pushing into him when he can. Maybe a miscue. Maybe looking for a dare there. Gets the down smash. But that backer at the very end connects. We're now yeah. in game five. Oh boy. Excuse me, guys. Yeah, I actually have no idea what's going to happen. Um, they seem to be just adjusting to each other back and forth. It's whoever we'll go to Founded Dreams. Yeah. Honestly, whoever controls it first, whoever can find control, whoever can kind of figure out the game plan for the match. Yeah. Honest is on far to figure out answers to Ford's new style of approaching the Falco Ditto. Let's see if he can do it. It's a tech chase. Catches him coming in. Up and far with an option here. Ford was stuck on the platforms for a bit, but finds the ledge and uses the invincibility to come back. Nice call there. Just waited to watch where the dare was coming down. Crucial edge guard here. Picks it up. All right, 69%. Good percentage for the crowd. Okay, they're happy, yeah. And now we're starting to hear some of those guttural screams coming from the crowd. A little bit. That mean they're, yeah. means they're ready to go. I think everyone's kind of charging them for top eight. I think there's a lot of, you know, people are worried. It's also, like, not exactly a slow-paced match, but a strangely-paced match. Just one of those, you know, one of those thinkers. Forward finds the high end of the stage there. Oh, nice pickup by far. Not an easy back air. He had a really good look at that recovery. He saw oh. exactly where Ford wanted to go. Oh, Ooh. nicely done. That was fantastic. He used the laser to knock him lower right into where his down smash range would be. Yeah, it was a great match from far, honestly. Um, you know, staying at that height and getting the down air, or getting the side B at that height. Not hard. I mean, not easy. Good DI from forward, staying away from any danger. Ooh, okay. Far is hunting down short hop, you know, ledge hop, double laser, ledge hop aerial. It was a Morgan's great catch with the up tilt off the ledge. Looking for the crouch cancel shine. He's gonna make it back even more of these double lasers off the ledge. Ah, kind of a DI mix up, but Ford was already ready for it. Safe walling bear, covering top platform. Ooh, Ford just lets him back. Far misses the ledge dash. Good down smash. Okay. Situation we've seen time and time again. Far gets to save this last, last hit, this last stock for a little bit longer. Oh, calls him out with a jump shine. Ah, great bait from forward there. But Far still living. Ah, misses another ledge dash. High pressure scenario here for Far. This would be his last match. If he loses, he would go down for 13. Forward hit the spot, dodge shine. Forward with some room to work here. Oh yeah. Great approach by forward. And Tech here chase. comes the work. 80% right off the bat. Shine bear out of shield, let's go. Oh! Far Great conversion. Far Anything can happen. up the stock. And oh. forward finds it. Off of the recovery platform, game five. Double dip. Well done. Great set. 
forward advances, he is going to play Taj for ninth. 